Hi, we're going to quickly run through using the uh, ProSlider OpenCart module, which is a replacement for the inbuilt native uh, slideshow module that comes with OpenCart. Uh, you can pick it up at the OpenCart market, go down to the module section, you can see it there, ProSlider, OpenCart module, brief description, some screenshots, uh, purchase price. Once you've uh, downloaded it, follow the PDF instructions for uploading the module to your <coughs> OpenCart store. Once you've done that, you can go to the extension module section of your uh, administration panel. You'll see ProSlider shows up. We're going to install it. We're just going to edit the settings. This is the main configuration screen. Uh, we'll go through it quickly. Title text, if you want, you can have the slideshow wrapped in a box with the title text. We'll just put this at Pro Slider for the time being. Uh, we can choose from all these different effects. Uh, we'll go random, a wrap box. This is what I was saying about you can have a box around the slideshow or not. We're going to choose not to have one. Uh, so it's just going to be pure images on their own. Uh, we want navigation control, so when someone moves over the slideshow, will it show the left and right arrows for the next slide and whatnot? Uh, do we want the slideshow to pause when uh, a user moves the mouse over it? We're going to go no. Uh, the width, uh, this will be dependent upon your site, but if you're using the basic uh, OpenCart installation, you can just follow the defaults as they're set there. Uh, it tells you them. Animation speed, how, how fast the transitions occur, 500 milliseconds is always a good option. How long uh, the slide pause, how long the slides actually stay uh, on the screen. We're going to say 5,000 milliseconds, which is actually 5 seconds. Uh, slices, we're going to say 20. We then drop into the, uh, the images tab and we're just going to add some images here. Uh, if you're familiar with OpenCart, you'll know about how to choose images. So we've got a couple here that we know are the right size. We're just going to call that slide one. If you want to put a link on that slide, you can. Uh, we're not for the time being. Call this one slide two. Where have we got them? Okay, slide two. Uh, layouts, we're just going to drop this module just on the home page, put it up the top, make sure it's uh, the first thing there by setting the sort order to zero. And that's basically it. We'll click save. Just have a look at the storefront. And there we have it. We've got the, the slideshow module working. You can see the controls here. We can flick through. There's a random effect, so each time it's going to be different. So the question really is, why would you use the ProSlider module instead of the inbuilt banner module? And the simple answer is, configure it, the ability to configure it in just about any way you want with timing, animations, uh, all kinds of things. You know, do you want it wrapped in a, in a title box or not? Images, it's all under one, it's all in one place. You're not flicking through system design, banners, layouts, all these kinds of things and then trying to configure modules to work to display those banners. Uh, it's all in one spot, your settings, your images, your layouts. It's all just there, ready to go, bang, bang, bang. It's very easy. And like I said, it's just highly configurable. You can choose any effect, your timings, everything about it is configurable. So that's it, that's the Pro Slider Slideshow OpenCart module.